Hello friends, welcome to Civil Quantity Insider by RG Practical Estimation and Costing Training Program. Our today's session on RCC Combined Footing Quantity Takeoff. Our content is how to set Excel format for RCC Combined Footing Quantity Takeoff. Quick walkthrough of key data entry points. Our next lecture on RCC cantilever slab and beam quantity takeoff. Stay tuned for more efficient and quick techniques in our upcoming sessions. Please like, share, and subscribe to the channel. This is a combined footing drawing. Size is 5 meter by 7.05 meter. Here is the two number of columns. This is a section of combined footing. Here is the give the details of steel reinforcement. This is a C type of top reinforcement bar. Twelve mm dia, two hundred mm center to center. Similarly, bottom reinforcement C type. Diameter of bar 12 mm, 200 mm, center to center. Side face vertical reinforcement, C shape, 10 mm dia, 250 mm, center to center. Here is the side reinforcement, horizontal. If depth of footing is more 1 meter or more than 1 meter, then introduce the side face reinforcement and depend on the consultant drawing. 10 mm dia 250 mm center to center. Here is the total number of bar. One is the top reinforcement both side. Similarly bottom reinforcement C shape both side. Vertical side face reinforcement C shape. And fourth one is the side face reinforcement horizontal. This is our Excel format for work out the quantity table. Here is our box footing, serial number, description, numbers, size of footing, length, width, tape, grade of concrete. Multiply numbers, length, width, and depth. Similarly, we call the PCC. Here, give the offset 100 mm both side. Depth is the point. Here is the PCC quantity. Now, length of bar, facing, number of bar, diameter of bar, weight per running meter. Total weight and diameter wise, steel bifurcation. And shattering quantity. Shattering quantity is perimeter of footing into height. And required data is grade of steel, grade of concrete, lap length, cover, and please consider bend reduction also. For 45 degree 1D, D is the diameter of bar, and in 90 degree 2D. For avoid the confusion, take a short length for footing first, then longer length. Because sometimes shorter length facing is minimum with compared to longer length. Now start with the top short length. Here is the short length 5.0 to 5 meter minus both side cover. Bar is C shape. Add 2 into 150 mm. Similarly, long side. 7.05 meter both side cover reduction plus 2 into 150 mm. Now diameter of bar and spacing 12 mm dia 200 mm spacing throughout 12 mm dia 200 mm center to center. Now how to work out number of bar? We consider short length and go for number of bar. Here we give the roundup formula G8 
38 is the longer side we work out the bar for uh, shorter side then uh, number of bar count in longer side g8 minus both side cover upon l upon 8 l upon 8 is the spacing plus one additional bar given to here now similarly work out the number of bar for longer side 7.05 meter now divide the length 5.025 similarly 5.025 give the round up formula divide it by f8 if it is the short length up minus both side cover upon spacing plus one number of bar extra bar. now we calculate the side face reinforcement side face reinforcement here is the two times both side length minus spacing 50 50 mm plus 2 into 300 mm for lapping end of bar here we give the one lap also 40 into d d diameter of bar and 10 mm divided by 1000 because diameter bar in millimeter here is the total length is 24 meter that's why we have to give one, one lap now side face c type bar this bar is vertical bar here is the mention start with from here to here and here is the given the details 10 mm bar to 50 mm center to center H8 depth of footing minus both side cover plus 2 into 150 mm. This length is the 150 mm. Now work, work out the number of bar for side face reinforcement. Here is the given spacing. 10 mm dia to 50 mm center to center 2.5 minus both side cover upon 250 mm spacing similarly c shape vertical bar here we calculate the first total perimeter of footing 2 into f8 plus g8 short length long length upon spacing it is the count is the 97 similarly work out the bottom short and long length bar here is the bottom short and long length as above if any changes in diameter please update it in here now work out the total weight here is the weight per running meter d square upon 162 number of footings total length of bar number of bar weight per running meter we get it total length track this formula similarly bifurcate the diameter wise c here we give the if formula if formula just i will explain you equal to if in bracket diameter of bar and freeze this cell only n function f4 equal to we work out the 6 mm type 6 comma if 6 then take this total weight just i have dropped this cell okay comma 0 similarly freeze this cell p function <coughs> f4 only p And 
drag this one over. Copy and change in only six to eight. Then eight to ten. Due to fix this N and P column, no need to drag the formula every time. Now we get it in single format. Concrete quantity, PCC. Total weight, diameter wise weight of steel and shattering quantity. Shattering quantity is the perimeter of tin into depth. Thank you very much, friends. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe.